Okay, you're welcome to Heroic Universal Concept International. Um, I want to quickly solve a challenge being faced by one of my students, Captain. Okay, um, Captain, I have to start from uh, with this. Um, anytime you encounter any issue, just go ahead and send it to me. It doesn't matter how many times you send me your, your challenge. The, on the only thing you have to do for me is to be patient. If I'm not able to solve it at that moment, be patient, okay, because I'm also solving other people's challenges, okay. Like tomorrow, I have another student of mine that just sent me something I was also looking into. You get me? So, but just once you encounter issue, don't allow it to complicate before sending. Just once you encounter it, send it, then I will create time to look into it, okay. So that's it. But try your best, as a matter of fact, as a developer, you have to also try to debug it by yourself try and try and try and try i know the the more you try the more you learn until you are exhausted have uh, having tried for hours if you are not able to debug it then you now send it to a more experienced person you get me okay now this is the issue the issue is that the slider is not showing okay the slider is not showing here okay but it it, uh, it was showing before but it suddenly stopped showing so what happened um if you inspect if you inspect element, let, let's refresh now. You are going to see here when you come down here, you see slider index is not defined. This but it, uh, this is where I want to focus more. Do you see this it, it's not getting this the script? Okay, the part. This part is not the actual the absolute part of the script. You understand? It's not the absolute part. And something happened when you go to the head section. You know, th this is actual the actual part of the script in my own. You know, your own is going to be different. I hope you understand. You no, know, th this is where I stored your file. You know, it's all the website I'm dealing on. As in all my student websites are stored in student websites. Okay, and this is the name. Uh, this is actually the copy of that your file. Okay, this is the absolute part in the URL. But this one is not an issue. This is where the issue is. This is where the issue is. When you go to include go to head then move down 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 you are going to see that you included a script here and the part of this script is different from the part of the actual part of the script okay you have to when you go down when you go to footer you're going to see that you also include a script there too this is this the actual script so this script is enough you don't need to include that one you included in the in the le in the head session so you have to um, comment it out. So the script at the footer is doing the job for us. No need including a script here. Hope you understand. So with this now, we've solved the issue of the script. So you see that the script is no longer showing, like the script, uh, the script not found is no longer showing. So what is also is showing now is slide index is not defined. That is from script a uh, js okay so we'll go back to the script js uh, go, uh not script js but slider js please so we we'll go to slider js okay we we'll go to slider js and um you see that you commented out this a slide index okay you commented it out so let's change it mm, it will show another error uh, assignment to const so you're not supposed to just assign constant to this because this is going to change. If you watch, you see that you change it here, and so so you have to use let here. Okay. So with this now, let's check again. Do you see now it's showing? And these are the issues. So the thing has shown now. So once you affect all these little changes, the case will be solved, and you are good to go. Okay. Thank you so much.